Okay, so with Danielle, what we're going to do, instead of her just blocking that arm like I was doing on her arm with the wrist and punching, she's going to use more of her body to come in and actually stop my punch. So nice and slow, she's going to come in, block this punch, but also using her elbow and her arm against my carotid artery on the side of my head. So she's doing this. So she's going to use her whole body coming in again, as you see. So as soon as she sees that person cocking up ready to throw, she's coming in to block that punch. Now what she's going to do is she's going to follow up right off the bat with a knee. Okay, so instead of the palm that I did, she's going to follow right with the knee, bringing me down a little bit. Usually when they get hit in the groin, a person gets hit in the groin, they're going to collapse a little bit. Okay, she could also hit the thigh like I did, but for this part, we're just going to have her do a knee. So she's going to do a knee to the groin, and then she's going to follow by twisting her body the other direction and an elbow to the back of the head. Okay, and this is using that rotational principle that we, were, we spoke about earlier we were doing the elbow, is that you want to get your hip and waist into that turn, the rotation of your body to hit with that elbow. So as you'll see when I'm bent over and she's doing this elbow, she's really using her hip to drive that elbow through. Okay, again, slow. Again. All right, a little faster. One more time. Fast. Good. Okay, so that's just one technique off a right hand hook punch.